and welcome back to Let's Play Story of Seasons for Yellow Towns. All right, let's go get those two barns down, or that barn and that chicken coop down, and then we can go get ourselves some new animals. Actually, before we do that, did I give you? Nope, you're not. You don't have any food. Uh, let's just put you outside to graze for a bit. Oh, I don't have any food in my inventory. One second. Let's just grab like a stack of twelve or so. But yeah, pretty much taking care of most of my animals. I think I missed some of the animals down here, actually. You're fine, you're fine. Anyone outside is fine. Oh, you two are still inside, aren't you? And it's kind of dirty in here. And you need to be sheared. I just completely forgot to take care of you. Whoops, sorry, Parsley. Let's get you outside. No, stop trying to eat. You can eat outside. Come on, get out. Parsley, get out of the barn. Oh my god. Okay, fine. You can stay inside today. Yeah, once you put fodder in their box, they just gravitate towards that no matter what. You can push on them all, they, all you want, but they'll just head straight for the box. And then, yeah, let's go check on the uh, buffalo, too. Pretty sure you have food. Yeah, you have food. Oh, you do need a brushing, though. Here, let's make sure you're not super stressed out in the morning. Speaking of super stressed out, I need food. Uh, I think I still have some rice porridge with me. Oh yeah, we have plenty of rice porridge. Well, one of rice porridge. I'm gonna eat that. Because we need to get rid of this tree real quick. Alright, so once we get rid of this tree, we can head up north and see Ludus. Or not Ludus, uh, head up north and grab some animals. After I put the barns down, of course. Well, barn and chicken coop. There we go. Also, more small lumber in case we need it. Oh, and I also should make sure that we sell everything we can today. I'm still totally for, like, at the end of the season. Why is everyone grumpy? I'm still at, totally for, like, at the end of the season, just selling every single gem I find. Oh, right. Uh, gotta get to the uh, bench. Selling every single gem I found during the season and seeing how much money I can make off of it. Actually, if I really want to see how much money I can make in one day, I would just wait to sell everything. Like, every single piece of cheese, every single crop. But I kind of don't want to do that. Because there is an advantage in this game to, n like, not doing that in the fact that you get town link uh, points for selling stuff every single day. Well, not every single day. But for just selling stuff, you get credit for it. And I need Lulu Coco at that lock by summer. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep shipping to Lulu Coco. Actually, how close are we to Lulu Coco right now? Ooh, we're actually not too far away. So once we hit that lock with Lulu Coco, I think I'm gonna switch to. Actually, I'm gonna switch to Siracusa. West Town is doing just fine even without us shipping to them. But they should be good. Oh, I was kinda hoping I could bounce from fence to fence. Also, I think I've just completely filled out the entire space up here. Oh wait, no, there are those two squares down there that we didn't uh, use yet, but they're filled with trees. And I kind of want to save those for makers. So yeah, we don't really have any more room for... Actually, I'm going to go to Syracusa first because they close earlier. We don't really have any more space for barns. So I'm pretty sure these are going to be our very last two animals of the uh, entire LP. Unless I decide to clear out more space up there somehow and move a couple things around. Which is entirely possible in case I find something rare. Actually, no, we do have plenty of space if I do that. No, never mind. We might get more animals. Who knows? That being said, at this point, yeah, I need a third herding pet. My two animals can't really handle all the animals I have now. How many animals do I even have now? Eight. Yeah, we have about 15 animals. We need another herding pet. We'll worry about that after the animal festival, though. Alright, so let's get that adult silk chicken. Well, Silky. I also just call them Silk Chickens. I don't know why. Oh, a name. I just realized I didn't think of a name for you. Uh, some kind of condiment that we haven't used yet. We have a ketchup, mustard, mayo, relish, salsa. What else is a really popular condiment? Vinegar? I guess vinegar. Or soy sauce. Actually, would soy sauce even fit? No, not really. Uh, actually, yeah, you know what, screw it. That's not how you spell soy. Soy, 
Soy Sauce. Whoa, Soy S. It's a nickname. All right, so we have Soy Sauce the adult chicken. Or not adult, the uh, silk chicken. Actually, it is adult. Actually, yeah, if we're getting that many more animals, we should probably get some more fodder too. Or not, yeah, we don't need fodder. We can get, uh, grab more grass seeds next door, but let's grab some more chicken feed just in case. How many, how much rabbit feed do we have? Oh, we're fine on rabbit feed. How are we doing this in terms of pet food? We're fine. Uh, treats? Uh, we can use a bit more. All right, we're good. That should hold us over for a while. Also, I still have not done any animal breeding. Mostly because animal breeding is kind of useless in this game. It actually takes less time to just buy a cow. And it's a lot cheaper in the long run because it takes forever for cows to grow up. Cows and a sheep and all that stuff to grow up. Also, you need a big barn. Also, is that all? That was all my milk. Whoops. I'll have to save some milk from tomorrow then. Here's something for you, Kasumi. Alright, let's head over to West Town. Actually, while we're in the area, I want to check one more thing out over at Ludus's place. I want to see what I'm going to need to upgrade my watering can. Because, yeah, if we can upgrade our watering can even more, that would be kind of absurd. And if we can upgrade our watering can even more, I think I'll plant more stuff downstairs in the cellar. Just because I kind of just want to limit myself to, like, how much I can water in a single thing with the upgrade watering can. So watering can, what is it to, right now we're at three, we're at three and one, right? Actually, what are we at with this thing? Yeah, three and one, or one and three, technically. Three by three. Ori calcum and gold. Ugh, that ori calcum. Yellow pearl. oh wait, yellow pearls. Oh, I sold all my yellow pearls. All right, next pearl harvest, we have to make sure we keep all the yellow pearls. And then we can do a three by two uh, square. All right. Well, that's good to know. Let's go get ourselves a llama. Oh, and yeah, while we're there, we should probably also grab more grass seeds, too. I think I'm just going to grab two, because two was enough to pretty much, like, give us enough fodder for the entire year last year. And it's actually going to be more silly now that we have... Oh, yeah, it's going to be a lot more silly now that we have uh, soft fields. We're going to have so much fodder. It's going to be kind of ridiculous, to be honest. Anyways, I think you sell grass seeds. Do you? Oh, yeah, you do. Two bags, please. And that's everything I need for you. All right, let's get ourselves a llama. So what What spice have I not used yet? Uh, buy animals. Where is... Wait, what the... Oh, never mind. I thought I saw the old classic Harvest Moon cow. Nope, just my imagination. There it is. The llama with the absolutely silly pompadour. Alright. So you shall be named... You know what? Screw it. We'll go with that. Since you are going to be kind of our last animal for a while... At least for now. Is there anything else I need to grab? Oh, we do have two empty fields too, don't we? Well, two or three. Yeah, let's go grab like three seeds, I guess. Actually, no, we have four. We have like one in the very corner, I believe. Uh, actually, yeah, we can just get by with one patch of grass now that I think about it. We don't need two. What do I want to plant there then? Cabbages, cabbages. All right, that should be good. Let's go home. There's nothing else I really need to do right now. Actually, is Stephanie around? Uh, I don't see her around. Oh, well. I'm just going to fast travel home. I don't feel like walking. Take me home, Bart. Take me home in your instant teleporting carriage. Okay, we're home. Uh, let me just double check something. Yeah, you have food. You're fine, Peggy. Let's go get these seeds planted. Oh, wait, no. Before we get the seeds planted, let's ship what we can. Uh, is there anything I don't need right now? Potatoes. We don't need 36 potatoes. Bellflowers, no. Cotton. 
Uh, yeah, we might as well just sell the wool. Food, I want to keep. Rice, we don't really need. I'm just going to sell that just to make some inventory space. Also, there's one thing I want to check before I forget. We put those turnips into storage, right? Yeah, we did. Shiso, daikon, radishes, broccoli, bellflowers. Okay, yeah, we're good. Actually, I put too many bellflowers in there. Whoops. Oh, well. Alright, so the animals haven't taken the an or the yeah, the pets have not taken the animals inside yet. Let's go check out our new animals. There you are, time. You and your silly, silly pompadour. Uh let's get those that wool off you. And now you look silly. Also, wow, that is some really dark wool. I forgot how dark the llama wool was in this game. Anyways, let's get, also get you some food. Oh, do I have any fodder? Actually, no. I'm gonna stick with sweet fodder with you for now. Just so I can get your uh, byproduct quality up. Or not quality, uh, quantity up. And then let's go check on the new chicken. Oh, deluxe fodder is complete. Uh, we'll grab that in a second. Hi, soy sauce. You're a good chicken. I'll check on you tomorrow to grab your eggs. Alright, so let's plant what we can. Cabbages, yep. One here, one here, and one here. And then I think I have an empty square down here. Yeah, we'll use grass here, I guess. We don't have to water it every single day either. We only have to, like, water it today. And we should be... Actually, no, we don't even have to water it today. I completely forgot about that. With grass, you just plant and forget. Actually, if that was the case, maybe I should have put down another field for it specifically. Like, just a normal field instead of a soft field. Oh, well. Too late now. Oh, I need a bit more food. Uh, we have more rice porridge, I believe. We could eat this, but that seems like a waste. Alright, so apparently putting tea in your porridge makes it weaker? You would think that, like, slight caffeine in it would make you stronger than normal uh, rice porridge, but guess not. Actually, yeah, that restored a lot less stamina. And it didn't give us the uh, buff buff. Buff buff? It didn't give us a strength buff. That's a shame. Alright, so let's go down to the cellar real quick, do a double watering, and then we'll head to bed. Maybe we should cook for Saluka too tonight. Actually, considering what happened last time we cooked, apparently it wasn't very good. Let's get some watering down here. We already put fertilizer and liquid fertilizer, so yeah, normal watering, please. Plus, I just want to get that juiciness up. Gotta make sure it's nice and juicy. Actually, juicy is like one of those adjectives I don't really associate with broccoli. Broccoli's not really a juicy uh, vegetable, is it? It's kind of crisp. Well, I guess it also depends on how you cook it. Either way, we're gonna make sure that broccoli is as good as possible by uh, season's end. Oh, I also wanted to go mining today. We'll go tomorrow. You know what? Screw it. Let's have dinner. And I'm gonna cook. Again. This time, let's actually use a recipe. Oh, uh, what can we make? What do I have the ingredients for? We could make soup. Oh, we could make Oh, no, I wanna keep all my turnips. Never mind. Make sweet potatoes? Oh, we could just make a boiled egg for dinner again. That seems to be our go-to meal. Is there anything else I can actually make? Oh, we can make French toast. That actually doesn't sound too bad. Or pasta. I want to see what the silliest thing I can make for dinner is. Grape juice. You know what's good? I'm just going to... Oh, wait. Do I want to... No, I want to keep my grapes. I'm just going to make a giant glass of tomato juice for dinner. We're juicing now. Oh, do I need to make side dishes? Oh, no, I don't actually have to make side dishes. So, yeah, our main dish is tomato juice. And some other dishes that we made. Thankfully, I didn't need to provide the ingredients for those. Oh, wow, tomato juice kind of sucks. That restored, like, one heart of stamina.
Anyways, time for bed. Hi, hi. Okay, so Luca kind of got stuck in the dog there for a second. She's fine, though. Alright, let's head out. Oh, wait. Is there anything special happening today? Today is... Oh, it's Ludus' birthday. Ludus is maxed out already, so that doesn't really matter. Let's go. Alright, so let's go check on the crops, and then we'll check on the animals, and then head to town for a bit. There's nothing we really need to do today other than get ready for tomorrow. Because tomorrow is the animal festival, and that would be something good to uh, prepare for. Also, Broccoli, hurry up and finish growing. I want to see just how awesome you are. I invested two season seasons into you. You would barely be near perfect by this point. Well, at least we know two stats are maxed out. Color and size. Juiciness is going to be... Oh, are these ready? These are ready. Juiciness is going to be maxed out by itself at some point. Eventually, even without fertilizer. Still, at some point, I do want to switch to Juicy Fertilizer just to help it along. But yeah, as long as we just keep watering it every day, that should just go up naturally. So all that's really left is color, is a uh, sweetness. Or not sweetness. Yeah, sweetness. Alright, let's go check on the rest of the crops. See if anything's ready yet. Oh, and the beverage bash is on Saturday, too. Uh, we're gonna need to make sure we get ready for that. I'm hoping that... Oh, cucumbers are done. Actually, you know what? We're gonna wait on the cucumbers. We should probably wait a few days to see if they grow more. There we go. Anyways. So, what was I saying? Oh, right. About the beverage bash. I don't know if the tea is gonna be ready by then. I'm hoping it is, but... I might have planted it just a bit too late for it to be ready in time. If that's the case, I'll have to trade over some tea. I don't want to miss this, just because... I just don't want to miss it. Actually, we should double-check if who is actually holding it this year. If it's Lulu Coco, that's juice. We don't need tea. But I'm pretty sure it always goes in order. So last time it was West Town, this time it'll be Suikusa. And then next time it'll be uh, Lulu Coco. I think it actually says on the calendar who's holding it this year. I'll double-check that when we get back to the house. And the pearls should not be ready yet. It takes about a week per pearl, so... We started on, like, the second... Harvested on, like, around the 7th or the 8th. Yeah, it's gonna be, like, another half week for these to be ready. That's fine. Tea's still growing. I have to remember, though. I need to save yellow pearls. Actually, you know what? Screw it. I'm gonna save all the pearls and sell them on that one giant... Am I missing a chicken? I'm missing a chicken. Oh, wait, no, there she is. I'm just gonna sell them all at one giant selling thing at the end of the season. Speaking of the end of the season, how are we doing with Lulu Coco again? Ah, uh, not too much further. Yeah, I think we could hit that lock by summer. Clean up the doo doo. Oops. Actually, no, that's fine. We could have left. Uh, we should probably check all the barns for doo doo, actually, now that I think about it. Yeah, it's starting to get a bit dirty in here, too. Anyway, speaking of animals, how are we doing? Oh, you're still at rank D. I was kind of hoping you would get to C at some point, but that's probably not going to happen today. Or in the next, like, day or so. Oh, well. Oh, why are you upset? Oh, you're upset, too. Wait, why are you upset? Um, okay. Yeah, some animals just seem to be easily, more easily stressed than others. I think it's based on their personalities, but I'm still not 100% sure of how each personality type uh, differs, for the most part. Anyways, I'll have to be sure to brush and milk and all that stuff with you. I'm probably gonna need to go grab more food, though. Also, you know what? At some point, I need to upgrade that brush. Honestly, we use so much stamina on the brush and the milker. It would probably be a really good idea to get those upgraded at this point. At least in terms of weight. Just so we use less stamina every time we use them. Also, screw it. Quick brushing for everyone. 
Also, treat time. Actually, you know what? Rosemary, you're switching to these treats, the uh, chewy treats. Because I just saw the uh, notebook. You're only producing three balls of milk a day compared to Pepper's 11. I need more milk out of you. Especially because I'm kind of only selling half the milk at this point. That's a hammer. Considering I'm only, like, selling half my milk. Also, hi, Silk. We got eggs out of you. It was brown. Also, chickens don't really get stressed out as much as uh, other livestock, so we should be safe keeping her inside for now. Yeah, I need to upgrade my brush at this point. Oh, that reminds me. Treats for you two. Yeah, I just want to get your byproduct amount up for now. I didn't sell her wool yet, though. I think I'm going to wait till tomorrow to do that. Or not tomorrow. I think I'm just going to wait on that, just in case we need a llama wool for something. Because, yeah, now we pretty much have access to almost every single type of wool in the game. The only one we're missing is the other type of rabbit. I mean, we do technically have room for one more bard at the end there. I was kind of hoping to keep that open for now, though. Also, yeah, we need food. And I don't really want to eat the food I have in my inventory. I think I'll go to town and have some food then before I finish up with the animals. I'll finish them up off screen then in that case. Oh, hey Sage. Surprised you're outside right now. Yeah, we have room for one more barn over here. Also, maybe at some point we should arrange all of our barns properly. Actually, all we would need to do is move that one chicken coop right there over to the right. Actually, I just realized just how many barns I have compared to chicken coops. I guess it makes sense, considering how much more valuable, uh, what is it, livestock are than poultry. Yeah, I think we have room for one more barn. And then that'll be it, because I don't have any more space to do anything up here yet. Not until I move those grape trees over to the west. Which I kind of don't want to do. I'm kind of happy with them there, but... No, we should probably move them over at some point, just so that they're with their uh, tree brethren. Anyways, I need food. And Luca, feed me. Your brother-in-law needs food badly. Uh, what do I want to eat? Let's have some ice cream for breakfast. Orange sherbet, please. Actually, how much stamina does that actually recover? Oh, quite a bit, actually. Hi, Saluka. Oh, I should have... Okay. I can't imagine that, actually. Oh, speaking of Wolfio, let's uh, register that milk. Oh, there's a silk egg. It's brown. Where's my milk? Oh, there's the milk. Uh, yeah, but where is Wolfio, anyways? Also, since when do we have parrots in the area? I haven't seen any parrots yet. Oh, Wolfio's over near Ludus. Oh, today is also Ludus's... I don't have bait registered. Today is also Ludus's birthday. Do you have anything he would like? I kind of have not really been carrying stuff that he likes, mostly because we're already maxed out with him. Do you think he likes bait? He might like bait. Oh, we should also be uh, rosemary hunting, shouldn't we? I guess I'll take a lap around town real quick. Happy birthday, Ludus. Also, happy Ludus's birthday, Wolfio. But yeah, let's take a quick look around town for some rosemary. I see plenty of quills that we don't really need, lilies we don't really need. Everyone's having tea but me. Yeah, we don't really have parrots around here. We have peacocks. Cheese is complete. I'll have to grab those when we get back. Okay, rosemary is supposed to be relatively common, but we're not really running into a whole lot right now. Uh, I guess we'll try some other day. There might be some in, the, some in the southern part of town, but I don't really feel like going down there. 
Oh, wait, one second. Oh, friendship event with uh, Tigre, I'm guessing. Hey, Tigre, whatcha up to? Uh, I'm just going to assume there is something on your face. We can't really see it from this angle. Someone's been crying. That's cute. Man, why is it with everyone in tea? Are they just mocking the fact that I don't have tea leaves available right now? It's growing, okay? I don't know. What is it called? We can't actually read from here. Oh, okay. It's just a really popular book. Actually, wait. Tikri, were you reading that book upside down? Yeah, the spine is on the right. You're reading that book upside down for some reason. That sounds really familiar, but I can't put my finger on it. I think it's based on something. Eh, uh, who knows. But at least he's reading. At least, yeah, it sounds about right for a uh, young adult novel. Novel. At least he's enjoying it. That's all that matters. doesn't look like it. Uh, both these are pretty much the same. Let's just ask if he was really that legendary of a person. We don't want to insult his grandpa. He's nice. I give him bait. Oh wait, I need to still give him bait, don't I? We'll give him some later. That's just... You know what? Never mind. That's pretty much just Saluka and Amuka, isn't it? Ah, oh, so that's why you were crying. Ray's cute. Well, not really cute, but he's a good kid. Also, hi, Hanani. What you up to? But no, I was thinking it was based on something in- some story in real life. I can't remember. Well, whatever. It sounds really familiar. So I guess it is technically based on a true story? Probably embellished quite a bit, though. Okay, yeah, those are just the twins. Oh, 
Also, I just completely forgot they were still wearing sunglasses. Oh! Actually, yeah, that makes a lot of sense now. Oh, yeah. Uh, you know what? It's actually fine for once. We don't have anything else we need to do today. We just came in here to try to get some lunch off you, to be honest. But that was a fun little event. Alright, back to work. I should wait. Oh, hey, all the kids are here today. Hi, Yaichi. You know what? No, we're fine for now. Oh, I guess he's not here anymore. Oh well. Huh. Apparently children can travel between the three towns, but the other people can't. Or they just don't want to. Well, either way. There's nothing else we really need to do right now, so I think I'm just going to call it an episode here. So, next time on Let's Play Story Season 3 of Towns, time for the Animal Festival, and time to win this thing. Unlike last season, where we just kind of completely lost to Mr. D. We're not going to worry about that anymore. Mr. D is gone. Forever. Okay, not forever. He's our dad, but still. So, till next time.